That's crazy. You trying to tonight? <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna give you an honest answer. No. Ah! But you can be what do you mean though. no? We yeah, yeah, I know women, they, they, don't, they, they, they don't get rejected, so that's crazy. Must stay focused, brothers. We must. The fact that the fact that a woman asks a question like that and is actually surprised, surprised when you say no, it shows that women never get told no when it comes to that. That that right there alone shows that women never get told no. She wasn't even a baddie. This female was not even a baddie. She is not a baddie. Hold on, let me. Sh she is not a baddie. The fact that somebody that look somebody that looks like her is surprised that someone said no. Somebody that looks like her. Just shows how easy it is for them, bro. But we can be what do you mean though. no? We must stay focused, brothers. We must stay focused. Cupcakes. I really, really, really love cupcakes. Do you also love getting diabetes? No, I don't know what that is. You gonna <laughs> learn today. This is your daily reminder to get your ass in the gym. Hey, shout out to uh PMP. Shout out to PMP. Working out sucks, but so does heart disease. The funniest part is the cameraman slowly backing away so he doesn't get splashed. No, but in all seriousness, for all the law enforcement and military service people, thank you for your service. You're a victim. The girl you seen in that clip is an OnlyFans model. She's known for doing public scenes and allegedly she got arrested for doing a scene near a school. But nowadays these content creators would literally sell our nuclear secrets to China if it meant they could get a couple likes. So you never know if this stuff is real. But if it is real, she belongs to the streets. How they started finding my mom's social media. Sending me a video of me sucking my exes. <laughs> like, oh, and you God. know what? I couldn't even respond to my mom. Whoa. I was literally like, I don't even know what to say. Oh. I literally was Whoa. looking at that text message God. crying. I, I crying. think every girl needs to watch this clip. Yeah. This is great. Crying. Never in my life thought my mom would have to see me sucking. But guess what? Because I was boss at I became a felon. What I do? I owe money. So well, I said, fuck your limits. Don't have how many money. of you. I love my oldest sister was a stripper. I always thought stripping was the most disgusting thing. What did I end up having to do? Becoming a stripper. Why? Because I put myself in debt, thinking I'm a boss. Not listening to my mom. That's what put me in debt. Not listening to my mom, staying the f home, and being smart. This is what OnlyFans sounds like. <laughs> okay. Yo! You know what? I, 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 I like that rant because, honestly, real talk, like, more girls need to listen to that. I, I think that was solid. Learn from her mistakes. I actually went to school with a woman that ended up being an adult film actress. Her new name is... And I'm trying to tell you, this stuff happens all the time. Her parents ended up deleting their Facebook because people kept sending them her scenes. One time somebody printed off a bunch of pictures from her scene and taped them to her parents' door. And I appreciate that woman's honesty because it's really a selfish decision. Nobody ever thinks about how it's going to affect their family and their future kids. It's like, well, if going out on a date with a guy makes me a s then that's just what I'm going to be. I don't think going out on a date makes you a s but having s with different men makes you make you a s well what does it make you if you have sex with different women a s maker bow, 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 dang bow. dang that comeback was fast as a mug city boy city boy somebody comes in for a job interview and in the last five years they've had 20 jobs how do you look at them it's a problem it's a problem somebody That's comes wrong. for a job interview and they're 32 years old and from 22 to 32 they've worked at two companies how do you look at them yeah Positive. Positive. I sit there and I say, wow, the same exact way we don't like to see people with too many jobs on their resume, we don't like to see too many boyfriends and body count on the resume. This Got him.
This is your reminder to hit the like and the subscribe button so more men can see this content. How often do you exercise? Number five. So I'm an Andrew Tate stan, so I don't know why the f you're talking to me, you silly little b**** there's a thin line between being funny and being an asshole i think i found the perfect girlfriend for him if we had a fight how would you make it up to me contestant number one hey how are you i missed you um, so i would gaslight you into you thinking you're the problem and then i would abuse you emotionally to you get to a point where you only I get satisfaction from me and if I tell you you look good or anything like that and then I would start slightly treating you better so you think I'm changing and then I it would be hey uh, believe it or not chat y'all know that females be liking that right females be really loving that stuff look she's actually kind of like low-key blushing they be liking that toxic stuff bro be this off and on until you're almost hooked for life and I'm like, almost like a drug to you where even when you're not around me and we break up like you're yearning for me like nicotine oh, and if that doesn't work I'd get uh go to a movie <laughs> <laughs> A movie, okay. All right, who are you most attracted to? The first one in the black jacket. You said the first one in the black jacket, or did you? What I tell y'all, chat? I never seen this video. I told y'all, that stuff is attracted to them, chat. I told y'all. I literally told y'all. I told y'all. To the guy behind him. <laughs> <laughs> That's a perfect example of being funny without being an asshole. The Bachelor is a TV show about a man who dates multiple women, mainly watched by women who hate men that date multiple women. If you could somehow see the type of guys your girl slept with before you, like a whole list of them, you wouldn't even treat her with respect. Life would be better like that. Like imagine as soon as you approach a girl, there's like an invisible list behind her that only men can see, and there's a list of all the guys with a picture next to them. You will just be in disgust, bro. You will save yourself so much time, headache. She's a tree, she's a tree, shorty over there's a tree, tree. Excuse me. I was wondering if you would um, be my boyfriend. <laughs> I appreciate having a girlfriend. You have a girlfriend? I'd yeah. pay you $100 a week. I'm worth more than that, I'm sorry. Oh, wow. 200 Sorry, I got enough. I keep telling you, consciousness over coochie, politics over punani. But... She got two kids from two different baby daddies. She a two now. She a two now? She a two? Ooh. She, she definitely in the negatives. hundred <laughs> percent. So you're not Red even flags. going for that at all? No, absolutely not. One okay. baby daddy's enough. That's enough. Right. Okay, one, yeah. If I'm a man and I have kids too, it makes more sense. But if I'm a man with options that doesn't have kids, why would I want to take care of somebody else's? Think of it like this. If you had $5 million and you went house shopping, would you rather buy a house that needs repairs or would you rather buy your dream home? Any girl I meet now, it's going to be impossible for me to ever prove that she would have loved me without my money. I mean, I see how quickly girls fall in love with me now. It's like this. I have one conversation with them. We have one date and they're ready to get married. It's like that. It's crazy. I can guarantee you with 100% it wouldn't have been like that if I didn't have the things I do. I mean, I take her to my, my apartment. It's seven rooms. I have a kitchen that's worth uh, 100000 I have watches worth hundreds of thousands. I have the jewelry that these girls dream of. And they say, look at my wrist. They look at me. I'm not a bad looking guy. And they look at my apartment like this is what I want. And so now I, I feel more seen through than ever. I feel more lonely than ever, even though I have more girls than ever. Woo! I'm about All right, Chad, listen. <laughs> about to go off let's go the eights the nines the tens when they're in their early stages are they going after the guy who works at cvs behind the counter are they going after the guy at the entry level job fresh out of college hell no they want chad and tyrone with the boat the lambo the resources and the high-rise apartment listen chad and tyrone ain't got the lambo and the high-rise apartment that's not chad and tyrone bro chad and tyrone's a dude that's fresh out fresh out Fresh out. That's Chad and Tyrone. They talking about that the ones that sleeping on the couch. They ain't got no resources. But you know what I'm saying? They got that dominant. They got that alpha look. They look like football players or whatever. Some type of stud. And those things I just said may take a man a decade to acquire. So these smoke shows get trips to Mykonos, rides in Lambos, rides in boats, all their early 20s while we're grinding in our 20s. So when I turn 31, 32, I'm like, move, you 30-year-old. Give me that 21-year-old in the back. Yeah, with the big fat wagon. Yeah, her. All I'm saying is this. Ladies, don't shame a man who's 30 who doesn't want to settle down. He's trying to live the life you are living your whole 20s. Exactly. Men are biologically attracted to fertility. Youth, beauty, big butt, and big boobs are all signs of fertility. That's why men like them. Unfortunately, by the age of 30, 90% of a woman's eggs are gone. At 35, women are considered high-risk pregnant. What? 
By 39, hold on. The study published by the University of St. Andrews, and, and, uh, that women have lost 90% of their eggs by the time they are 30 years old and only about and only have about 3% remaining by the time they are 40. What? That's, bro, chat, that's crazy, chat. And by the age of 40, 97% of a woman's eggs are gone. So 30-year-old men tend to date younger women because biologically that's what they're attracted to. So if you're a woman, it's best to try to lock down a man when you're younger. Don't wait until you're 30 and then try to shoot a buzzer beater. Let me know in the comments below if this video was a WRL and give me the... Hey, chat, has any of y'all... I know it's not many of y'all in the chat right now, but have any of y'all ever heard of uh, Poor Man Podcast? I'm gonna see if anybody heard of him. Anybody, any of y'all heard of Poor Man Podcast before? Yeah, nah, yes, yes. His channel is dope. Yeah, he does got a, he does got a good channel. Okay, so most people know who he is. All right, cool, 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 cool. Yeah, shout out to him. He does make really great content. 